It's been a momentous year at SickKids, a year in which we launched not only an historic fundraising campaign, but a number of bold new initiatives and partnerships that will transform pediatric care at SickKids across Ontario and beyond. Without the ingenuity of our people, the support of government, SickKids Foundation, and our partners, these achievements would not have been possible, and I'm so grateful for everyone's commitment to our vision for the future of child health. We're thrilled that the province has committed to investing in the transformation of our campus, joining the Sick Kids community and the hundreds of thousands of individuals, families, corporations, and organizations who have already stepped forward to do their part. Building the Sick Kids of the future is going to take all of us, and I'm heartened by the tremendous support I've witnessed over the past year. This year, we launched the $1.3 billion Sick Kids versus Limits campaign, the largest campaign in Canadian healthcare history. And we've been humbled by the generosity and overwhelming response from our community and the new donors who have joined us. Before our official launch in October, a very special group of 110 corporations, individuals and organizations, we call them Catalyst Donors, had already committed a minimum of $1 million each to the campaign. And over the months of November and December, we asked 5,000 new monthly donors to join us and 6,479 signed up. By year end, we have raised a record $146.3 million from 300,000 donors. And together, our campaign has now raised $625 million from half a million donors. What amazing generosity. The Sick Kids vs. Limits campaign will support three key elements. Reimagining the Sick Kids campus, including building a new patient care center on University Avenue, continuing breakthrough pediatric health research, and establishing partnerships for better coordinated patient care. The stories in this annual report highlight the milestones achieved over the past year that take us one step closer to achieving our vision for improved pediatric care in our province and beyond. We've already made Sick Kids an even safer place for patients and staff through our Caring Safely initiative. We've exceeded most of the targets set for reducing preventable harm and have seen great improvement in our safety culture. Staff, leaders, and over 300 safety coaches across the organization have come together in pursuit of providing the safest, high-quality care to our patients. In addition to our many bold hospital initiatives, last year we began building momentum for our new campaign with the award-winning Sick Kids vs. Undeniable video. It helped us become the number one Canadian brand overall according to Strategy Magazine's 2017 report card. This year, we followed up with another jolting emotional film, rooted in the need, the passion, and the urgency to build a new Sick Kids, and starring over 200 Sick Kids patients and their siblings. Called Sick Kids vs. All In, the spot portrays kids from all over the community coming together to take on the monumental task of building a new modern hospital. It's a rallying cry that calls on our community to join us because without philanthropic support, our vision for the new sick kids just won't be realized. With the support of our community, we've also generated increasing momentum in our research mission as well as in our efforts to build partnerships across the healthcare system. Together with our colleagues at Holland Bloorview Kids Rehabilitation Hospital and the Children's Hospital of Eastern Ontario, we've created the Kids Health Alliance. This alliance will help us extend a continuum of excellent and safe care much closer to home for more children across the province. And by building connections between the hospital and the Sick Kids Center for Community Mental Health, we're building a model of more seamless care for our mental health clients that are at the highest risk. While shovels won't hit the ground for the new Sick Kids until the end of the year, there's already so much transformation underway. We're thankful to all of you for helping us shatter the limits of outdated facilities, knowledge and models of care and for helping us unleash the full potential of sick kids.